Just five days after laying off 150 teachers, the TSC administrators and teachers union representatives met behind closed doors to begin collective bargaining. But the meeting didn't last long. Tiffany Dismore was there. Tiffany, what happened? Nicole, the TSC Teacher Association representatives tell me they left the collective bargaining meeting disappointed. The Tippecanoe School Corporation administrators and Tippecanoe Education Association representatives met behind closed doors in this building. The teachers union presented a proposal they believe could save the 150 teachers who were laid off last week. It includes salary and benefit concessions. TEA co-president Heather Brooks was ready for a long night of bargaining. I thought that we would come together and problem solve, take a break, go back to caucus, um, maybe that they would respond to our proposal with a counterproposal and we would go from there. We were prepared to camp out, hammer this out, go as long as we needed to. was fully prepared to spend hours here this evening to discuss the issues, to come up with suggestions on ways to help the TSC and the students. And less than 10 minutes was just extremely disappointing for me. TEA co-president Ed Tilley says he was surprised with how the meeting turned out. I'm hurt. I'm really hurt as a teacher, as a taxpayer, as a patron, my children are in TSC, that we didn't sit down and talk about this. Superintendent Scott Hamback says the meeting was the first opportunity to hear proposals from the teachers. This gave us an opportunity to receive their proposals, then the board will be able to meet in executive session, review the proposals, and then you know respond accordingly and be able to share uh, information from the board's perspective in response to that proposal. Hambeck says the school board will meet in executive session later this week to review the union's proposal. Administrators told the TEA they would meet by May 4th. Brooks says time is running out. Now, teachers would like to know now what they're going to be teaching next year, whether they have a job or whether they don't, and we owe it to them. And to drag this out another two weeks is just a disservice to our students, our teachers. Brooks says included in the proposal are some ideas a group of parents presented to the TSC last week. Handback says the process is give and take and hopes in the end both parties will come out feeling comfortable and satisfied. To see the proposal the TSC parents put together that the TA says they included some of those suggestions in its proposal to the administrators tonight, you can go to our website, WLFI.com. Tiffany Dismore, News Channel 18.